all that's left for us to do at this point is uh the key to the castello i've heard this can be a bad sequence for some people but yeah at this point i think the full map should be unlocked or it's about to be all right um yeah let's see okay so we have to go down there that's fine uh is there a safer way down yeah we'll go down this way and then speak to the banker oh still no funds to withdraw all right um let's check out yeah let's check you out here my gear I can I can't even buy a full set of armor wow shop quests haven't changed I can buy a one crossbow bolt I don't think we're gonna need the armor quite yet more better armor uh, especially I know next sequence well we're completing this sequence and then that's yeah we'll be where we I want to be which is after because after the sequence will be sequence eight when you start as soon as you start sequence eight you're pretty much kind of stuck into finishing the game and then and there's nothing wrong with like finishing the game the issue is after you finish the game you then have to wait a while to then actually get back in yep so i have that and that's for the vatican so we need ambergris and up of ears, Splenctium, so we're not going to get that for a while. You need only lift your gate. Although here, um... Smoke bombs are actually needed for something. Uh, we don't have enough for that. We don't use poisons. We don't use the knife belt, really, either. Because, yeah, now we use, uh... Yeah, that's all that for now. Um. Hmm. Alright. Let us see, let us see. What is the left? Oh, can we only buy this map for the center district? Because that's where we're at. What happens if we go here then? Yeah, can we then, like, buy the treasure maps for, like, that district? I'm intrigued now. Okay. I think you got to do something to get the feather map. Because there's a feather map, I just don't remember how you get it. Uh, this is wide and open. Let's grab the horse. Yeah, because I thought it's like you have to buy things kind of in the district that you're trying to buy them in. Or buy them for. So, like, central maps have to be bought in the central area. Yeah. And I think that's really it. Like, uh, also different districts have like different colors or different dyes. Yeah. Hey, hey. Yeah. Which, so then you'd have to be in that district to yeah. buy a certain dye. You kind of got to know which district or which dye you want and which district it's in, which hey, hey. then becomes yeah. its own headache. Yeah. But like, the stables should be fine. Uh, let's see, just kind of meander our way around. Yeah, all right. Buy this art merchant shop. Ponte de Art. Uh, speak to him. Yep, so he sells the Campania treasure maps. Or what for? Yeah, like four and six hundred. Alright, so we have... That's... Okay, so now we have to go buy an art thing here in Antico. That's technically an Antico one, so I guess we gotta go there. And then bam, that'll be all the treasure maps aside from the Vatican one, which we can't really get until 
We need some chests to unlock a bunch of other things. Uh, where is actually the nearest fast travel station from where we're at? Where are we at? Alright, we are here. Gotcha. We got a ways to go. Alright. Hop on the horse. Yeah, just so that way I have all the treasures unlocked on my map. Don't worry. Alright, no feather up there. But yeah, and then I'll also have to look up how we get the feather yeah. map. I mean, we have most of the feathers already. So it's not that hard. Again, I'm still not doing the uh, army list things because yeah. they're not necessarily required for 100% completion. I just like to do them. Because to me, it's like, oh, well, that is technically the 100% completion. Or not for... That is for the synchronization to actually do the game. Just because it's like, well, you need the best armor. Where is it? Yeah, we need to go. Okay, we need to go to the forum. And then we have to go quickly grab that by the maps. And then we need to go to the Thieves Guild. And I think that one will just automatically start then. No, let's uh, get rid of that. That's for a Templar mission. We're not going to mess with that quite yet. Again, like, we're going to try to get... Hey, we got more money in the bank now. Again, the goal is really at this point... Oh, we might actually meet... Where's it the nearest bank to, then? Yeah, we might have to stop at a bank. Oh, it's, like, right over there. No, let's stop at the bank, because we're probably going to need some money to buy the maps and everything. I don't know which bank we're missing, actually. Um, hmm. And we'll find out. Let's get over here. Do, do, do. Oop. Uzi. Why would you shame yourself this way, Ah, he's lucky Ezio didn't kill civilians. Because rebranded does. Am I dreaming this? Uh, let's see. Speak to the banker. Let's draw some funds. And I think, like, we can actually let that accumulate for a while at some point, but seeing as, like, you need money for a lot of things and you don't just accumulate it as, like, amass it so much as you did in, uh, in 2, it feels like. You're pretty much constantly trying to remove more money to spend more money. All right, so we would have had enough to unlock the shop at least. Uh, I need to go back to our guild, to the guild house, and uh... yeah. So bam, we got those. Um, they also sell different paintings at everyone too. Great, I forgot about that. Um. Yeah, alright. Um. Wait, it just said something about the Forge of. Treasure map acquired, region map updated. Alright. Decreased notoriety. But yeah, so pretty much we now have all the treasures are now on the map. It makes our map look very cluttered. Uh, the wrist is nearest assassination. Assassin Coop? Probably over here. Alright. Let's go to that, because then we'll start sending people on a bunch of missions. Because, again, missions get us money, they level up the assassins, and also, they make it so... Uh, we get... They, they also unlock more contracts, which some of them actually give us the things we need for... For some of these quests, so like the Vlad the Impaler coins, we can get quite a few from oh, from these uh, assassin contracts, like the Spudis, uh prayer beads. I think the Ambergris also comes from one. Like they do a lot of, like they pretty much try to set it up so like you can make sure everyone gets up. Like you'll be able to unlock everything. And I think they try to make it so you're not sitting there like 
struggling for hours trying to figure out where, where like I was supposed to get this, like the nutmeg. I remember the nutmeg still being hard to find regardless. Might have been like two from chests and one from the mission. All right. All right, so you leveled up, you leveled up. All right. Contracts. I send a level. All right. I send. Nope. No point in sending. We'll do it like that. Level one might be able to do this on their own. Yep. Barcelona. Even. So this is Amber Grease is here. But we can't even do that just because our guys aren't even a high enough level. There's a gold ingot. I think that's just for selling yet. Can't do that one. Maybe this one. Alright. Wow. Alright. Did a riot. Alright, we'll just keep him on, on hold. Uh, we'll actually use him later. Alright. And yeah, we're just trying to complete all these contracts. It, that's a, just like a nice way to level up the assassin. Oh, there's a, the treasure right here. Alright. Yeah, it's down here. Alright. Like, it helps level them up. It gets you some nice money. Also gets you some items you need as well, so it's like... It's... A, I didn't mind the minigame. Um... I didn't remember it's like... You do it a lot in this one, and I think in Revelations. Uh, I didn't play a lot of 3, so I can't say much about 3, but like... I completely didn't even realize it was a thing in uh, 4. Until like my 3rd or 4th playthrough. And I was just like... Where do I get this thing? And I was like... Oh, you apparently have to do these missions that almost no one ever does. Because it's not something that like they really talked about, I felt like. It was like when you uh, collect the ships, and you sent them to your fleet, that's what it was for. And it confused me every time. Also, I like how it's just called the Thieves Guild. Well, like, the Rosé de Fiore isn't called the brothel or something. Because, like, Thieves Guild has an actual name. Oh, let's go by the stable center back here. Might as well. And whoop. Stable's bought. Yeah, we got money. We should probably spend a little bit of it to up that Rome uh, passive income. Damn. We only got three of those. Okay. And, like, that'll also be something to slowly work towards is actually completing everything. Uh, that'll be after the sequence. Uh, are we starting a mission? We are. No, no. All right. Check with the daggers. Buongiorno, Ezio. Hello. It is time to pay a visit to Lucrezia's lover, Pietro. Hey, I've let's go find Pietro. I sent my men out to find him. Molto bene. Ezio, if I may. No, you may not. Someone warned Rodrigo to stay away from the castello. Oh no. Machiavelli. Do you I mean, have proof? It's an no. assumption. We must not be split apart by mere suspicion. The Borgia know the locations of our spies. Oh, no. Who told them? Maestro Machiavelli asked about our search for Pietro earlier today. Ezio? Ouch. Oh, wow. All right. Um. All right. So just don't drop. Did say don't drop below five? Do not drop below five health screws. OK. So, be careful. Gotcha. 
Do my job. Either way, level up it. Why is it showing a, uh... Should already have that synchronization point, though. Alright, uh... I still do not believe Machiavelli has turned hmm. traitor. We'll have to look at, into that later. I mean, that would be a shame if he was, but... Eh, we'll find out. Lead the way. Hey, hey, Just following La Volpe. Yeah. Alright. I like the music in this game though. It's always like it I yeah. I don't know if it's the same as in yeah. two. It's gotta be at least very similar. Volpe, can you hurry up? It's hard to remain in the area when the guy's running away out of the area. And so are my friends. I can't help them. When the guy's all the way out there. There we go. What were you able to Jeez. find out? Pietro is to be assassinated this evening. Cesare sent his butcher. And eh. Alright, and we're basically going to be doing this over and over again. The best killer in Roma. No one escapes him. Until tonight. Come yep. on. Let's go. But yeah, so now, as you can see, like, this mission's are relatively quick. It levels them up. It's a good way to quickly level them up, too. Uh, get some decent amount of money. It's a small amount. But the goal is to, like, eventually be able to send them on to, like, the 15-minute ones where... They'll be doing them for like during like an entire mission and coming back with actually good rewards. And really, the goal is to be trying to send my uh, keep my highest level guy with me.
Wow, he just ran away, so I just... Not on him. And there we go. Did you uncover information about Pietro? Yeah, did you? Man is an actor, and he is performing in a place that not dead. Oh, I remember this one. I think I remember this one. This was a fun one. Oh, yep, yep. I remember this one now. Yep. Yeah, this is like an interesting one. Um. Yeah, when you see the play, you're going to be like, oh, oh, that's dark. It, it's a fun one. I actually liked this mission. Like, it's a very memorable one. I didn't realize it. I thought it was in two. I guess that's why I was... Again, two and Brotherhood are like very much the same in the fact that it's like, oh, it's all Rome. Like, it's it's pretty much all Italy. And it's Ezio. Ezio from like... Yeah, he's a little punk in uh, 2. And like here in Brotherhood, he's 40. But like, the only difference is beard and no beard. But he has a beard at the end of 2. So it kind of blurs that even more. In fact, you see it during a uh, sequence at the end of, what is it, sequence 12, I think? Yeah, I believe it's sequence 12. So like, you're so used to Ezio, you get used to Ezio with a beard, that you're like, oh, he didn't have a beard? And then you're like, well, he had a beard in two, and he has a beard in three, in Brotherhood, and just all like kind of crosstalks. You tend to forget which one is which. What did you find out about Pietro? Yeah, what did you find out? If he suspended from a cross, Nicoletto will come for him with a spear. Yes. More background information for you guys. Uh, let's interact with this. Oh, by the last thing we can from Michelangelo it's or... The French are pulling out of Roma. Ah. The Baron de Valois was found murdered within his own camp. Yes, I wonder why. Could it have been an assassin? There are rumors which favor such a theory. Never ah. listen to gossip, Leonardo. It could get you into trouble. Good advice. <laughs> I love it. Just a quick recap. Yeah, I did it. Don't worry about it. And bam, we'll get poison darts. To my workshop. Wait here. <laughs> I love that. All right. And here we go. Our gift. Just a small sting, and my enemies will fall. Do, 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 do. 